Sure. So some of the goals that we have uh, for this season, obviously we want to make the playoffs. It's been, you know, with the COVID year last year, it was, it was a downtime for sure. But even the year before we missed out on the playoffs by I think around like one match. Um, so I want to get back there for sure. I definitely want to participate in the ECAC tournament as well. I think any opportunity to play in the postseason is great, especially when you have a crop of young players who aren't necessarily used to playing into November. So I want to give them that opportunity. Um, and as far as myself, you know, I just want to be a positive uh, reinforcer on the team, uh, a, a force for good for them, so to speak, so they can learn each and every day and help contribute to the team and the FDU community as a whole. I think this season we got off to a really good start. We had a lot of freshmen come in that brought a lot of really good energy to the court and a lot of skill level. I definitely think that we're competing at a higher level than we have in the past, so it makes me hopeful for this season. Um, we did a lot of team bonding, a lot of fun activities to get to know the girls and to establish more connections both on and off the court, so it's going well so far. You know, having a crowd can be a blessing or a curse. Uh, I think it depends you know, as long as the team can handle it well and, you know, feed off the energy from the crowd and get hyped and be excited to play and I think we'll definitely be able to win some games. I was super excited to be named a captain this season. This is my fifth year with the program. Um, I've been working really hard these last five years and I'm really excited to do it with Casey and Adrian. We're all in different classes so it makes it interesting rather than just having all seniors. So we all get like different perspectives at different levels and I'm just really excited to work with them.